Once upon a time, in the mystical realm of ancient Chinese mythology, there existed a deity known as Pangu. This legendary figure, according to lore, hewed the universe from chaos with his mighty axe. He crafted mountains and rivers, the sky and the earth, and all that we see around us. Yet despite his monumental creation, Pangu was plagued by doubt. It's a feeling we're all too familiar with, isn't it? You've crafted a project, designed a product, or perhaps even built a business from the ground up. But then, a tiny voice whispers, is it good enough? Could it be better? Perhaps it's all for naught. That, my friends, is the insidious power of negative self-talk. Just as Pangu doubted the worth of a world he'd brought into existence, we too often question our own achievements and capabilities. We undermine our confidence, belittle our accomplishments and second-guess our decisions. And in doing so, we dim the light of our potential. Imagine for a moment if Pangu had succumbed to his doubts. If he had allowed his negative self-talk to convince him that his creation wasn't worth it. We wouldn't have the world as we know it, would we? William Shakespeare once said, Our doubts are traitors and make us lose the good we oft might win by fearing to attempt. This rings true for us today. Negative self-talk is a traitor to our success. It hinders our progress and robs us of opportunities we might otherwise seize. The power of words is immense. They can build us up or break us down. The words we speak to ourselves in particular carry great weight. They shape our beliefs, influence our actions and ultimately determine our destiny. Like Pangu, we too may fall into the trap of our own negative self-talk. But remember, we also possess the power to break free. And that, dear friends, is the journey we're about to embark on. In our careers, negative self-talk can be a destructive force. Now picture this, you're standing before a mirror, staring at your reflection. The voice in your head begins to chide, you're not good enough, you'll never succeed. Why bother trying? This, my friends, is the voice of negative self-talk, and it can be detrimental to our professional lives. Negative self-talk has a way of becoming a self-fulfilling prophecy. It's like a dark cloud hovering over your career, raining down doubts, fears, and insecurities. And when we allow it to persist, it can lead to decreased productivity. You see, when we constantly tell ourselves we can't do something, we start to believe it. This belief, in turn, saps our energy, diminishes our focus and hampers our ability to perform to the best of our abilities. But the impact of negative self-talk goes beyond productivity. It also hampers our professional relationships. When we're tangled in the web of self-doubt and pessimism, we tend to become isolated. We shy away from teamwork, avoid networking opportunities and miss out on the chance to build fruitful professional relationships. And let's not forget about career growth. Negative self-talk has a knack for clipping our wings just as we're about to soar. It convinces us that we're not capable of achieving more, of reaching new heights in our career. As a result, we become complacent, settle for less and limit our own career growth. Remember the ancient Chinese myth of the self-doubting dragon? Despite his immense power and majesty, the dragon was convinced he was just a small, insignificant creature. His negative self-talk prevented him from realizing his true potential, and as a result, he lived a life far beneath his capabilities. In the same way, negative self-talk convinces us that we are less than we truly are. But remember, as the wise Lao Tzu once said, the words of truth are always paradoxical. While negative self-talk tells us we can't, the truth is we can. We just need to silence that destructive inner critic and replace it with a voice of positivity and self-belief. The science of psychology provides insight into how negative self-talk affects us. This is where we delve into the intriguing depths of our minds to understand the mechanisms that make negative self-talk such a powerful influence on our lives. Imagine a situation where you're facing a challenge. Now, we all know that challenges can be stressful, but the way we talk to ourselves about these challenges can significantly amplify or reduce that stress. Negative self-talk, such as telling yourself, I can't do this or I'm not good enough, can trigger a stress response in your body. Your heart rate increases, your breath quickens, and your body prepares for a perceived threat. This is because your mind cannot distinguish between a real threat and a perceived one. So when you tell yourself you can't handle a situation, 
your body responds as if it's facing a real tangible threat. This constant state of stress can take a toll on your mental health, leading to issues like anxiety and depression. Negative self-talk can also severely impact your self-esteem. If you're constantly telling yourself that you're not good enough, you start to believe it. And this belief can prevent you from taking on new opportunities or reaching your full potential. Now let's consider an ancient Chinese myth. The story tells of a painter who created a tiger so lifelike that it jumped off the canvas and attacked him. This myth serves as a metaphor for our thoughts. When you repeatedly picture negative outcomes or tell yourself you can't achieve something, your mind creates a reality that mirrors those thoughts. It's like the painter and his tiger. The tiger wasn't real until the painter convinced himself it was. But here's the good news. Just as our thoughts have the power to create a negative reality, they also have the potential to create a positive one. By replacing negative self-talk with positive affirmations, you can change your outlook, reduce stress, and improve your self-esteem. You hold the brush to paint your own reality. To quote the Chinese philosopher Lao Tzu, watch your thoughts, they become words. Watch your words, they become actions. Watch your actions, they become habits. Watch your habits, they become character. Watch your character, for it becomes your destiny. Our thoughts have the power to shape our reality. Recognizing negative self-talk is the first step towards overcoming it. We often don't realize that we're our own worst critics, but once we do, the path to self-improvement becomes clearer. So what does negative self-talk sound like? It's that little voice in your head saying things like, I can't do this, I'm not good enough, or I'm always making mistakes. These are all examples of self-deprecating phrases that chip away at our self-confidence and hinder our progress. Negative self-talk is a tricky foe. It's sly, often slipping in unnoticed under the guise of realism or practicality. You might think you're just being realistic when you say, I'm not the best at this. But in reality, you're undermining your own abilities. How can you recognize it? Negative self-talk often comes as an overgeneralization. You make a mistake and suddenly you're always messing things up. It also thrives on words like should or must, placing unnecessary pressure and guilt on you. It's the voice that magnifies every small setback, turning molehills into mountains. Remember the ancient Chinese tale of the farmer and his horse? When his horse ran away, his neighbor said, such bad luck, to which the farmer simply replied, maybe. The horse returned with a herd of wild horses and the neighbor exclaimed, what great luck. The farmer again said, maybe. The tale continues with alternating good and bad fortune, reminding us that it's not the events but our perception of them that shapes our reality. As the wise Lao Tzu once said, Watch your thoughts, they become your words. Watch your words, they become your actions. Watch your actions, they become your habits. Watch your habits, they become your character. Watch your character, it becomes your destiny. So next time you catch yourself thinking, I should have done better, or I always mess up, stop and reassess. Are you falling into the trap of negative self-talk? Remember, it's not about ignoring your flaws or mistakes, but about addressing them constructively. Awareness is key in the battle against negative self-talk. By recognizing these patterns, we can start to challenge them, replacing the negative narrative with a more positive, empowering one. Let's embark on this journey together. Overcoming negative self-talk is not impossible. In fact, there are proven strategies that can help you reframe your thoughts and drive positive change in your professional life. Firstly, let's talk about positive affirmations. These are statements that you repeat to yourself designed to challenge and combat negative thoughts. They're not simply wishful thinking, but a deliberate act of replacing pessimism with optimism. Think of it as a shift in your internal narrative. For instance, instead of saying, I'll never get this promotion, you might say, I am capable and deserving of career advancement. The second strategy is mindfulness. Now, this is not some esoteric concept. It's about being present in the moment, observing your thoughts and feelings without judgment. When a negative thought intrudes, acknowledge it without criticism, then gently guide your mind back to a neutral or positive focus. 
This practice can help you break the cycle of negative self-talk. The third strategy is cognitive restructuring, a psychological technique used in cognitive therapy. It involves identifying and disputing irrational or maladaptive thoughts. For example, if you often think, I always mess up, stop and consider, is this really true? Most likely it isn't. You've had your successes, haven't you? This process helps you to challenge the validity of negative self-talk and replace it with a more balanced view. But remember, it's not about denying difficulties or pretending that everything is perfect. It's about changing your perspective, acknowledging your strengths and learning from your mistakes rather than berating yourself for them. In essence, these strategies help you to become your own best advocate, supporting and encouraging yourself in ways you do for a friend or a colleague. And this shift from negative to positive self-talk can have a profound impact on your career, boosting your confidence, enhancing your performance and opening up new opportunities. Replacing negative self-talk with positive self-talk can transform your career. And it all starts with you, with the words you choose to tell yourself every day. So start today, change your narrative and watch as you craft a more affirmative, more successful professional story. Coaching can be a powerful tool in overcoming negative self-talk. Imagine you're sailing a boat. You're the captain and the crew, but there's also a persistent nagging voice that doubts every decision you make. That's negative self-talk, and it can steer your career off course. But what if there was someone else on board? A mentor, a guide, someone who can help you navigate the choppy waters of self-doubt? That's where coaching like that offered by M. Joga Coaching and Consulting comes into play. Career coaching isn't about handing you a map and telling you where to go. It's about helping you understand the map you've already got, your skills, your experiences, your aspirations, and then guiding you to chart your course. A coach can help you identify negative self-talk when it arises. They can provide you with strategies to redirect these thoughts, transforming them into positive affirmations. They can help you see that the voice saying, I can't, is just a whisper in the wind, not the captain of your ship. But a coach does more than just help you combat negative self-talk. They can also help you develop a positive mindset, one that encourages growth and fosters resilience. They can instill in you the belief that you are capable, that you are worthy, that you can achieve your career goals. And perhaps most importantly, a coach can hold you accountable. When you commit to overcoming negative self-talk, it's easy to backslide, to let old habits creep back in. But with a coach by your side, you have someone to remind you of your commitment, to keep you on track, to celebrate your progress. So if you're ready to silence the negative self-talk and steer your career in the direction you want, consider reaching out to a coach Remember the words of the great Chinese philosopher Lao Tzu, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. With the right guidance, you can turn your self-talk from negative to positive. At M. Joga Coaching and Consulting, we believe in your potential. We are convinced that each one of us has a unique gift, a special talent that the world needs. But sometimes, negative self-talk can blur our vision, making it hard to see our own worth. That's where we come in. Our goal is to help you overcome that negativity, to clear the fog and let your true potential shine through. We want to invite you on a journey of self-discovery, a journey towards career excellence. Consider this an open invitation to book a complimentary career breakthrough call with us. Let's sit down and discuss your career goals, your challenges and how we can help you navigate through them. Don't let negative self-talk define your career. Let's redefine it together. Let's overcome negative self-talk together and propel your career forward. In conclusion, negative self-talk is a powerful force that can limit our career success. It's fascinating how mere words, when repeated to ourselves, can actually shape our reality. But it's not magic we're dealing with here. It's the power of the human mind. When we constantly feed our minds with negative thoughts, we create a self-fulfilling prophecy hindering our potential and limiting our career growth. Remember how we discussed the impact of negative self-talk? This invisible foe can cause stress, reduce our self-confidence and even lead to depression. 
It's not just about feeling gloomy, it's about the tangible ways these feelings can affect our performance at work, our relationships with colleagues, and our ability to seize opportunities. The good news is we can overcome negative self-talk. We can change the narrative. Like the ancient Chinese story of the farmer and his horse, we can choose to see events in a different light. We can train ourselves to replace negative thoughts with positive affirmations, creating a healthier mental environment. Coaching plays a crucial role in this journey. A coach can provide the tools, techniques and support needed to change your internal dialogue. They can help you identify the triggers of your negative self-talk and guide you in developing strategies to counter it. It's not about denying your feelings, but rather about acknowledging them and choosing a more empowering narrative. We at M Yoga Coaching and Consulting are committed to helping you silence that negative inner voice and propel you forward in your career. We are ready to walk with you on this journey towards positive self-talk and career excellence. In the words of Wayne Dyer, the only limits you have are the limits you believe. So believe in your potential, believe in your worth, and believe in the power of positive self-talk. And remember, we are here to help you break through those limits and reach new heights in your career. Remember, the only limits you have are the limits you believe. Wayne Dyer.